Question 1D asked us to kind of use some knowledge that we'd already used earlier in the question. So we were given all these financial indicators for the last two years. And then we were asked to calculate the amount of other expenses that would have appeared in the income statement for the year ended 31st of December 2022. So the thing here is other expenses aren't listed there, so that makes it tricky. And secondly, it says this is for 2022. So we're only using the data in this column and not this column. So how can we answer this? So um, to do this, you need to use your knowledge of what the gross profit margin and the net profit margin are. And to do that, you really need to do a little bit of vertical analysis. So that would be, and remember we're just doing 2022. That is where we express every number in the income statement as a percentage of revenues. So in this case, if revenues are 490,000, that's 100% of itself. What else do we know? We know the gross profit margin is 56%. 56% of what? 56% of net sales. So in this case, 56% of 490,000 is 274,400. Now, we can work backwards and get the cost of goods sold. We don't need it here, so I'm just going to move on and say, well, the net profit margin was 6%. 6% of what? 6% of net sales, which in this case is your revenues of 490. 6% 6 of 490 is 29,400. And what we've been asked to do is actually then calculate this bit, this other expenses. And to do that, we just use a bit of backwards engineering. We go, well, if the gross profit was 56%, and the net profit was 6% and gross profit is less other expenses equals net profit. Well, the difference must be 50%. 56 less 6 is 50. 50% of the net sales of 490,000 is 245,000. So that is our answer. So we had a calculation box, so we can set that out however you like. When there's a calculation box, there's no right way, there's no wrong way. That's how I would have set it out. Um, just remember there were two marks. So in this case, I gave one mark for the net sales, gross profit, and net profit, and then one mark for calculating the other expenses here. The really important thing is to set out your workings out. Because this was two marks, you might not get the right answer, but you might get some back sort of uh, some carry forward marks for maybe getting something right earlier and then just making a mistake later on. So always show your workings out in the calculation boxes.